What's going on everyone? My name is Max. I'm a communication skills coach. What I do on this channel is I look at all different types of people's communication skills. Today, we are going to be checking out XO. I've seen many, many, many requests for these guys, so I'm looking forward to checking them out. If you like my content, do your boy that favor, hit that subscribe button, and as always, if you want to watch all of my uncut reactions, including my uncut reaction and analysis, of this video, all you need to do is click on my Patreon link below. First time reacting to EXO. Here we go. 역사의 시작이죠. EXO 역사의 시작이기 때문에 가장 기억에 남는 것 같아요. No. 첫 번째 oh. 쇼케이스. 음, 네. It's great. <웃음> 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 I love that memory. I love it. Okay. <웃음> reaction, reaction, <웃음> 진짜. <웃음> Guys. Interesting. I believe that Suho, he kind of took the lead there, so I wonder what his role is in the group. But he seems like a really chilled out, laid back guy. I wasn't sure who the guy next to him was. The dude in the center to the right. Good looking dude. Chan Yo seems like a character. He actually seems more on the outgoing side. He likes to engage the rest of the guys. I'm just getting that sense. The guys on the top right and left, so I believe that's Si Hoon? Si Han or Si Hoon? and then D-O on the top left. They seem a little bit more on the quiet side. D-O, I noticed he kind of was looking over and it's almost like he really likes to see what the other guys think and connect with them on that level. Oh, that's a big deal. <laughs> Times Square is huge. Yeah. When you saw that, how did you feel? What was the nukim? I mean, the guy front and center next to um, Suho, he seems, if I had to guess, like he seems almost like the most socially comfortable. He doesn't seem uncomfortable at all. He seems to be carrying himself with a lot of confidence. If you look at him, he looks relaxed. He's not breaking eye contact. He's smiling. And although it doesn't look like he's fluent in English, that doesn't seem to bother him. Yeah, it's a big deal. <laughs> big deal. Huge deal. Yeah. Yeah. How cool. Ooh. Yeah, Kai is really getting a kick out of this. Look at Kai. He's kind of cracking up listening to Chan Yo speak. I think he's really getting a kick out of this whole English Korean thing. Oh, oh man. Oh, my God. Come on, man. You know? Very cool. Yeah. Okay. Come on. If I, if I. Dio, he seems like he's like almost skeptical of the interview and he's like unsure of what the hell is going on and almost like not enthused to be there in a sense. You know, he's the type of guy that you don't want in your audience when you're doing a public speech because like you just get nervous. Like, is this guy like not into this? Like what's happening? <laughs> I'm like low key. I would be like most intimidated by Do. He's like really assessing everyone that speaks. You know, he he seems like he's got a pretty strong BS detector. I get the sense just looking at him. He's sort of, he's not as naive, like he's more skeptical of people. He's more, if I had to guess, direct. He hasn't said anything, but just the way he's observing people, I get the sense that he's judging them more sharply. Oh, Kai's got an interesting demeanor in this interview. I'm not sure if he's like, maybe he's not taking this seriously, but he seems to sort of have a different energy than the rest of the guys in the group. He's sort of like on his own island. Think for your comeback, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Can you give us a little bit of what it's going to be like? Oh. What's the color? You know, what, what's, it, what's it going to look like? Yeah. We're waiting, you know? Just give us a nugget. I like the guy next to Chan Yo. Like he seems very genuine and, and notice just in his response, like you can tell he understood what Ellie Lee said just by his reaction. Oh. Oh. He's really being thoughtful here, it looks like. 
어, 아직 색을 입히지 않았기 때문에. 어, 오케이, 오케이, 오케이. 오케이. 네. 맞아, 맞아. 색을 입히지 않았기 때문에 뭐든지 다 어, 흡수할 어떤, 수 있고 어떤 색이든 다 입힐 수 있는 지금 그런 상태입니다. 오케이. 오케이. 야. That's cool. Baek y a n and uh, Suho, they seem tight. But Suho seems like a really kind person. And I like how he made the conscious effort to translate what Ellie Lee was saying to his boy behind him, Baek Yan. He might be the leader, if I had to guess. Kai's giving me super star, star vibes as well, but you know, he, he's, he's coming across to me as just a little bit maybe arrogant in this interview. That's just the vibe I'm getting from him. He just doesn't seem as connected to the rest of the guys and he's sort of laughing but not being involved. Like, it, it doesn't look like he's super interested. And you know I'm not a hater. Who else? Drake? Drake? Oh, Drake! Oh, we Drake. love Drake! Drake. Chris Brown? Chris Brown? We can. Who? We can. Oh, we can. Maroon 5. Maroon 5. Maroon 5. Maroon 5. Maroon 5. He's super cool and comfortable. I wish I knew his name. The dude next to Chanyo. If I had to pick anyone to have a conversation with, if I felt like I needed to feel more comfortable, it would probably be him or Su Ho. Well, Chanyo as well, you know, he's got like an ounce of shyness to him, but ultimately I do think he's very outgoing and has a lot of charisma. Maroon 5. Ma Maroon 5. Maroon 5. Maroon 5. Right, right. Yeah. Maroon five. Um, okay, Beyonce? But look at the way that this dude is holding eye contact with Ellie Lee. Keep in mind how he's sitting, very relaxed. He's not really closed off. He just looks comfortable. Bakyan seems cool too. He seems very laid back and comfortable as well. Very confident. What is the biggest difference between American fans and Asian fans Good question. in Asia? Um, 뭔가 표현력이 조금 더 좋은 것 같아요. 이게. 그러니까 지금 리액션 또 네. 이렇게 좋으시잖아요. 네, 리액션이 되게 좋으시니까 리액션이 되게 커요. 그래서 커, 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 뭔가 공연을 할. I like how Bakyan. Sort of speaks and carries himself and explains himself. He seems very clear and confident when he communicates. And we can feel it, right? He did it with his gesture, a big, broad gesture. Yeah. Yeah, I guess Kai is a jokester. Like he's definitely not taking this interview seriously at all. Done. But it's Suho. You know, he, he's he's sort of carrying this interview in a way. Him and Baek Young, Chan Yo, and the guy next to Chan Yo are really carrying this interview. Can you say something in English to them? Anything. I love you. There you go. Uh -huh. <laughs> Thank you for your love. Yeah. Oh, oh love, love. <laughs> Love. Yeah, Chan Yul's a jokester, huh? I feel like he's like the first guy to get goofy and he's funny, man. I do like his vibe a lot. Dio, man, like Dio, like what's up with Mr. Skeptical back there, Dio? He's sort of like, he hasn't like moved his position. He's sort of like looking around, looking at the other guys. <laughs> and on that note, ladies and gentlemen, XO, comes on me. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. I feel like not a ton went down in that interview. I feel like I need to definitely watch more XO. Back Hyun, I feel like he can really impress me. I feel like low key, he's probably got some really good communication skills. Suho as well. That was my first glimpse of XO. As always, if you want to watch my uncut reaction and analysis, you can. All you need to do is go to my Patreon page. I've included the link in my description below. Other than that, my name is Max. I will catch you soon. Peace.